My name is Ty. And I'm Amber. We've been going to Front Range almost since the beginning. We started just a few months after Front Range opened their doors. It was just very welcoming. It really was immediately a, uh, a place where you felt like you were home. We were lucky enough um, to watch the evolution. We were there at Mesa, then at the theater, and then at high school. And then during COVID, wherever we could con somebody into meeting, they did a wonderful job through that. And I think that says a lot about our church. I had been through um, a building campaign before with the church that I was with. Went through the whole process of praying about what my contribution would be. And, and God really challenged me about that. I'm, I'm an engineer. Everything has to be done in a spreadsheet and calculated and figured out. And, and I went through that and calculated what I felt like I could give. And God challenged me to give three times that amount. And um, he and I had some serious discussion about that. And he won. And so I, I gave. I committed to give more than I was comfortable with. And um, he was so faithful through that entire giving campaign. And when we moved into that church building and I saw the growth that, that the church experienced through that, the programs that we could offer um, in the community, the just the outreach that we were able to do by having a permanent home, the way the community took us more seriously, like we were gonna be around, we were for real. Um, when that happened. And I think that, that Front Range is gonna see exactly the same thing. I'm really excited. There was no hesitation this time. It was, it was like, yes, we need a building and how soon can we get into one? Providing a building, a structure, a place just gives people the sense that we're here. We're not going anywhere. We're here for the community. We're gonna be here for the community. We're gonna grow with the community and uh, we're gonna love the community. Anytime you look at a, a campaign like this, you have decisions to make. And everybody looks at their finances differently. And you have um, what's in front of you. And you can say, OK, if, if I do this and, and if I contribute to this campaign, then what am I giving up? And for us, it was looking at things like, you know, are we, are we going to delay putting this money towards paying our house off? Are we going to delay retirement? Are we going to delay some of those things for for this campaign? And you know, we looked at each other and said, "Yeah, yeah, we are. Yeah, we're going to do that. God will come in and and provide a way for us to continue to do this. We, we both firmly believe that. We keep growing our commitment as our finances uh, become available, or as we look to make them available. Never in my life have I regretted being generous. It's not a donation to something." It's you buying in to what this church believes in, and it, it makes you feel like you're part of it. So when we open those doors, and you know that you've contributed, and you are a very real part of making this thing happen, it's a feeling that you can't get anywhere else.